Thank you for tuning in, and this is my review for Lord of the Flies, theatrical movie version, 1963, versus the theatrical movie version, uh, 1990, of Lord of the Flies. Okay, let's make it short and sweet. Uh, as we stated before in my past review, um, in Lord of the Flies, the novel versus the theatrical version, 1963, the two are exactly the same. Um, so with that said, um, the 1963 version of the movie um, and the 1990 version is pretty much the same review as the novel versus the 1990 version of the movie. So other than that, uh, which you can see actually above, you can go see that review above. I have it right up here. Um, let me just give you a rerun of everything else. First off, let's talk about movie quality. Obviously, in 1963, we're talking about black and white. Um, so you're going to have black and white. Your aspect ratio is going to be 4 by 3. Uh, let's get technical. Um, you're obviously going to have a 480i. The quality is not the greatest. So on and so forth. Fine. So in the 1990s version, you have uh, widescreen. You have color. Your aspect ratio is better. So on and so forth. Okay, moving on from the um, technology aspect. Um, as well, in the 1963 version, you get a better understanding of the novel, how the characters are portrayed, and um, you get a better understanding of the themes. It, uh, the 1963 version is pretty much the novel put to life, so you're able to understand everything. Uh, the 1990 version, uh, the, the writer, the, the, uh, the one who decided to uh, make this version, sort of changed it up and added their own spin to it. Um, they decided to keep one of the pilots alive. They decided to um, withdraw from certain parts of the uh, novel, including um, the uh, beast, uh, which the little ones and many of the uh, people are, many of the children are scared of, and other little aspects are, are taken away, and some aspects are added. For example, um, uh, the savagery, uh, how savagery is shown how uh, bloodthirst and pretty much the fragility of civilization all that um, is uh, stronger you can there's more sense of it in the 1990s version because again because it's in color and because uh, there are more effects involved um, I guess the um, the ideas trying to be portrayed um, you're able to see them uh, in better clarity due to the fact that uh, not only is it newer, there are more effects, and uh, the 1990 version deals with again more savagery, uh, more but more bloodthirst, and more uh, it shows more fragility uh, of civilization. So again, my final verdict: um, please go see the version of uh, my review for the novel versus the uh, 1990 version. 1990 version, sorry, of Lord of the Flies, which should be. Uh, exactly above yeah right up there and um, if not uh, no big deal pretty much there are uh, a few major differences but then again uh, in all end they're both depicting Lord of the Flies one a little older than the other but both pretty close in detail so that's my review thank you and take care